Hey guys, it's Casey Godin from Premier Martial Arts. Just wanted to update you on the mistake that I actually made this weekend. I sincerely apologize to Coach Heather and everyone confusing you on what's supposed to happen for Coach Heather's finish line. I, for some reason in my calendar, I had it um, on Sunday. I think Sunday is supposed to be our rain date for Coach Heather to actually run the marathon. Um, so my mistake, I sincerely apologize, but hopefully we can fix it as fast as possible. So the marathon she's gonna run is gonna be Saturday. She's going to start running about 9 a.m., which means she'll cross the finish line somewhere between 1 o'clock and 2 o'clock. Now, the best part about running a marathon is the finish. So when you're done, it's the most amazing feeling. We want to make sure that Coach Heather actually has that feeling when she crosses the finish line. So I have an idea for everybody. So we're going to make a little finish line for her. Her family will be there. You know, my, my team will be here to help her cross the finish line. But in between one o'clock and two o'clock, we want to simulate what happens at the Boston Marathon, the finish of the Boston Marathon. If you've never seen it, never experienced it, it's insane. It's like you're a celebrity. And on both sides of the street at Boylston Street in Boston, there are tons of people and they're cheering their minds out for you. It's one of the most exhilarating, most awesome, like amazing experiences. So we want to make sure that Coach Heather actually has that experience. So. Um, in the parking lot of the school, okay, probably more towards the main road, not near the actual school because there are other businesses here. We don't want to disturb them, but we want to make a uh, finish line tunnel. So if we can actually take our cars and we'll park them, you know, two by two down, uh, down the parking lot, make a little tunnel for her to run down the middle towards the finish line and we can cheer our brains out for her. So our goal is to have at least 10 cars, five on each side. Okay, uh, kind of parked front to back with the finish line at the very end. So people can line up with their chairs and their families and still be a little bit socially distant. But when we line up our cars, we can actually create that tunnel for her to run down, run through to our big finish line so we can go crazy and cheer for her and give her the moment. Um, and the reason why we want her to have this moment is because she's trained not once but twice for this marathon and she helped raise a ton of money. So the goal was to raise 12,500 and we did it with a lot of help from the students and families. Um, we want to make sure this is the crowning moment, like the big finish line for all of us, for all the work we've done, all the fundraising, all the work that Heather has done. So she's actually trained, like I said, for the marathon twice. She trained for the whole season. Then they actually canceled the marathon that she trained all summer in the insane heat. And she's ready to do her, her marathon finish. So it was a pretty big deal. So if you guys can actually come down and be part of our marathon finish line, that would be absolutely phenomenal. We don't have to have, uh, just 10 cars. We can have. 20. The bigger the tunnel, the more people cheering for her, the more of a cool experience is going to really be for Coach Heather. So um, if you want to be part of our marathon finish line, our, our car tunnel, please let me know and I'll kind of like, I'll block off um, who's going to park where and how many cars that we actually have, how many people will be there. So that would be phenomenal. Um, there are normal classes going on on Saturday uh, as usual. Miss um, Murray will be teaching those. I will actually be um, following Coach Heather on her marathon route in my car to make sure she has water, make sure she has what she needs. Um, any assistance that she needs, I'll have that in my car and I'll be keeping her safe while she's out there running. Some of the areas you're gonna run through, it's pretty like side streets and you know, kind of out in the, in, the, in the country just a little bit. 26.2 miles is a long way, so we had to go through some, some smaller streets. Um, but I want to make sure I'm be with her to keep her safe. Miss Murray will be doing some awesome classes for you. Okay. Any questions, guys, give me a call. Um, if you want to be part of the marathon um, route, you can call the red phone or the school phone, which is 978-771-1912. Or you can actually uh, call or text my personal phone, which is 978-994-1089. And thank you so much in advance for helping this, making this an awesome experience for Coach Heather. Thanks, guys.